So once you have your website open in Canva, you are going to go to the left side of the screen and you're going to select text. Afterwards, you are going to select add a text box. Once you're done, you are going to open up a new tab in your web browser and you're going to type in WhatsApp logo transparent background. And then you're going to select one of these images. Once you've found an image, you are going to go to the right side here where these three vertical dots are. And then you're going to select share. And then it's going to give you a link in which you can copy at the bottom. You're simply going to right click and you go to select copy link. Then you're going to go back to your camera design and you're going to right click on the text and you're going to look for something which is link. Now where it says enter a link, you are going to right click, then select paste within the open space. Then you go and select done. After that, you're going to go back, you're going to select more, then go back to edit link. Now under display mode, the default is going to be link. So you're going to choose embed. And as you can see here, it has embedded the WhatsApp image logo instead of the link. And then you can just adjust it and then put it wherever you want to within your website design. I can put it at the bottom left corner or the bottom right. So now if I publish the website, go to the top here and select publish website and then select republish website. Now I've already created this website before. That's why it says republish website. But if it's a newly created website template, then it's going to say publish website. So simply click republish website, then wait a few seconds. Then once you're done, select view website. And as you can see here, our WhatsApp logo has been added and it is transparent. And there you go.